here's a quick look at a nice little dish that I'm doing. It's got plantains, sausage and peppers, and onions, and the best is yet to come. Okay, guys, I'm back. So I'm a little cramped with my stove, you know. Uh, call me Squirrel Tribe Prepper and Cooker. I know that's a long name, but I want to fashion it after my uh, one of my favorite I want uh, um, YouTube channels. And um, this is no competition because she does other stuff, but um, sort of like honoring her. But I also could relate. I'm a squirrel. I am all over the place. I will interrupt my own my own presentation and tell you about something else, as you can see. So I think I'm also a squirrel, but I also feed my squirrels up. Um, I have a tree right outside my deck, touching it practically. And so I love squirrels. No shame in being like a squirrel all over the place. So here we go. So I already pre-cooked um, steak. Okay. And I pre-cooked my plantains with onions and peppers and, and fresh garlic. Uh, and so I, I kind of like boiled the steak in purified water with, with um, what do you call it, white vinegar. And this is a, a Latino favorite. Now, I do it my way. But believe me, my way is the best. The only thing that's missing here is corn. I'm not a big fat corn lover, but that's why I used to do it when I was 15. When I used to um, go stray and uh, against my mother's wishes, come home in the middle of the night and cook for myself. Yep, at that age. Thank God that I'm still alive. Okay, thank God. So now what I'm going to do is I am going to pour a lot of this here. Look at all these onions. Look at that. Beautiful, delicious. In the brine of uh, brine of uh, white vinegar. So I'm going to keep cooking this. Everything's pretty much cooked because it cooks easy. You know, this, this, um, the meat is tenderized and all that stuff. All right. So now I'm going to put it back in the saucer. This time I, I actually want it watery. I really do want it watery with some of that delicious. <clears throat> okay. Doesn't that look good? It's pretty much already cooked, but now I'm going to let it cook together because the meat had a lot of onions, but the plantains had a lot of garlic. So I wanted the garlic to bake the flavor in. Well, I want it to bake in the flavor, however you want to say it, right? And so this is almost done and my rice is also on its way. Okay, folks. So here's my rice. And this is already in high heat, so I'm going to turn it off. I just put the high heat for a little bit, let it let it cook by itself. Thank you for watching. Okay, and here we go. Voila. I am hungry. I've been wanting to eat this. Something about onions cooked in white vinegar that makes it just too delicious that um, since I got a new local restaurant that's Spanish, I've been getting the temptations and I will pour some of that fantastic, I'm going to call it sauce, juice, whatever you want to call it, is going to give some flavor to the rice. And I have, there's more juice where it came from. Thank you. for watching. What do you think? This is my squirrel meal because I'm all over the place when I'm cooking and I'm quite proud of my dish. And believe me, oh, let me let me get a main ingredient. Hold on a second now. Hold on a second. My guacamole. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Get this a little further. Come on, please. It's gonna get cold on you, baby. Let's do this. 
Let's do this, girlfriend. Oh, it just, it doesn't want to just stay up. Maybe I should do this. Okay, there we go. Now, now, by now my guacamole changed a little bit. It turned a little bit. But I'm fine with that. Just give me a second as I, oh boy, it's my dish in. Give me a second while I reach for a pretty spoon, I guess. I mean, I have, I have fresh. Oh boy, I have fresh. Sorry, I'm really messing up this film out right now. Fresh avocado that I could cut right now, but my my guacamole is to die for. It doesn't matter how good or bad it looks. So give me a second, folks. Oh, I put some of this. Right in the center. Believe me, I'll be coming back for more. It's got plenty of onions. Mm -mm -mm. Guacamole tastes good. I could eat this guacamole alone. And I'm really a fussy eater. So here we go. Thank you for watching. Zoom, zoom. I am hungry. Pow.